Hello guys, welcome back to Chris Polly channel. This video I want to share about sneak peek for 8 September 2021 maintenance update. Okay, to enjoy watch my video, make sure you turn on this video subtitle and also you can use timestamp that I already provide to go to target topic that you want. And if you haven't subscribed yet, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on bell notification to get any update and guide on Black Desert World. Okay, let's start this video content using any feature that I provide. Okay, this is official website for SEA Server Maintenance Notice at 8 September 2021 Maintenance Update. For SEA Server, this maintenance will occur as always from 6 am until 10 am GMT plus 8. And be noticed, at this time, website also will be maintenance. Okay, the reason for this update, first they will add function to repair cooking utensil and alchemy tool durability. Actually, this update just implement from Global Lab Update at 27 August 2021 that you can repair your cooking utensil, especially for advanced type and supreme type. And after this maintenance done, I will try to to use this nearly broken cooking utensil or depleted durability cooking utensil to get this repair material so just stay tuned on Chris Poly channel for this update and next they will update barter information window to add some filter function and this update just implement from global lab update at 27 August 2021 in this video I show you this barter window will be update to have some filter to find any barter item that you want and you can check on my previous video for more detailed explanation about this barter list filter function okay next reason for this update, they will add special quest to make you can make difference between Akman Temple Portal and Hysteria Ruin Portal. And once again, this is just implement from Global Lab Update at 27 August 2021 that you can start this quest line from Karasu NPC. And be noticed, this is family quest that you only can do it once per family to get this feature to differentiate between Akman Temple Portal and Hysteria Ruin Portal. And after this maintenance done, I will make special guide to finish this quest line and how it's look for this new Akman Portal and Hysteria Portal after you finishing this family quest. Okay, next reason for this update, they will remove liberation system on Conquest War and new rank point system will apply after this maintenance done. And this update just implement from Global Lab update at 19 August 2021 that they announce will remove Seeds War liberation system and change it to become point. And point that you get is depend on your guild activity based on any building that you destroy from enemy guild and also remaining durability for your command post. And because this is ranking system, the reward for its rank also will different after this maintenance done. You can get special reward from one place until the sixth place and also more than sixth place, you will get participant reward if your command post remain there and not got destroyed during this seeds war. But if your command post got destroyed after this seeds war, you will get another lower tier reward after this seeds war end. Okay, that's all the reason for this update. Next, about ending event. From the server, there are three events that will end after this maintenance done. Okay, first event is World Boss Grand Slam. After this maintenance done, double chance boss gear drop rate will be end after this maintenance done. And all drop rate for this world boss item will go normal again. Okay, next event that will end is event goodbye summer, hello 24 hour XP time. After this maintenance done, server buff for combat XP plus 300% and skill experience plus 50% will be gone. And the last event that will end is Corsair Awakening Countdown reward. Actually, this is special attendance reward that you can get until day 21 to get this event Marine Romance Outfit Box that you can open it with any character in your family. And this special attendance reward will be end after this maintenance done. So this is your last chance to get the last day after the 7 September 2021 reset time to get the last day for this special attendance reward. Okay, that's all 3 events that will end after this maintenance done. Okay, next about new outfit info. After this maintenance done, we will get new ranger outfit that you can purchase it until her awakening outfit. As you can see, this is how it's look for this new outfit for ranger class from any side and also you can use feature to hide cap to get another look for this outfit and as you can see this is how it's look for its bow and also for its quiver for this main weapon outfit and also outfit for her awakening weapon and sub weapon and be noticed this headgear will not replace your current hairstyle so you can combine it with your custom hairstyle when wearing this headgear okay that's all detail information for this new ranger outfit that will release on our live server after this maintenance done and next about preview for upcoming new outfit that will release at 
15 September 2021, it's mean for next week maintenance update, they just show us new outfit for Kunoichi, and this Kunoichi outfit will release on Korea server after this maintenance done, and will release on our live server at 15 September 2021 maintenance update, so just wait until next maintenance update to get this Kunoichi new outfit. Okay, that's all any info for sneak peek for 8 September 2021 maintenance update, and special thanks to all my membership for direct support via Patreon, Karya Karsa, and YouTube membership, and also my current member, Zekru, Dubiadut, Jimmy Snake, Doki, Transester, Aganim Skepter, Rene Gets X, Licky Cleaners, Aegis to Guild from NA Server, Gospel, Homi, Ayrton, Suna, Tepan Gaming, Killsteel, King Denmark, Wemi, Cloudy, Puff, S Gold member, and also all my silver and bronze member. Thank you so much for all your direct support. This will make Chris Poly channel running and growing more faster. If you want to support me directly, I will very grateful. And as special thanks, I will put your name on my video, depend on your support level. And be noticed for some level, there are have some limit. So make sure you didn't get run out for this limited space. And I will put your name on every subsequent video that I release for the duration of your support. And if you want to join my membership to support me directly, you can go to any platform for Patreon, Karya Karsa, and YouTube membership. I already put link for this membership on this video description. Or you can check on top right of this video, I already put card for Patreon link. If you like this video, you can like and subscribe to my channel for another guide and update. Thank you for watching, see you next time!